Welcome to Poisonous Plants 1 to 1, a story about poisonous plants told in 121 seconds. Euphorbia pulcherima, poinsettia, is a plant that always gets discussed as preparations for Christmas are being made. You'll read that poinsettia is a deadly poison, and that it is not at all toxic. Both are wrong. Poinsettia is poisonous, but the toxicity is so low that there is very little chance of anyone ingesting a sufficient quantity to produce symptoms. It provides a perfect example of the difference between poisonous and harmful. Even sites that claim the plant is not toxic usually say that ingestion of a substantial quantity of leaves could result in gastrointestinal upset and, like all euphorbias, it has a milky sap that can cause skin problems if not washed off. Those wanting to say poinsettia is deadly point to a case in 1919 where a two-year-old girl in Hawaii was found dead under a poinsettia tree, holding, it is alleged, a leaf. Subsequent investigations have established that poinsettia was not implicated in the death. The folklore says that poinsettias were first part of Christmas in 16th century Mexico, when a poor girl was told by an angel to offer a weed as a gift, and the angel turned the leaves into a beautiful red display. It was not until the 1950s that its inclusion in Christmas became popular, and that resulted from some very clever marketing. Very clearly, the tradition of having poinsettia in the house at Christmas was commercially driven. It is difficult to keep from one year to the next, and it is even more difficult to get it to produce its characteristic red leaves after the first year. So it is an ideal plant for retailers, as most people will buy new each year. For a lot more information on poisonous plants, please visit www.thepoisongarden.co.uk.